Listen up, boys and ladies and gents. Today we are on a little adventure of what you can do in Korea that are non touristy things. You know, you know about the Lotus Tower, you know, bridges, the sunsets, Hongbuku Palace stuff. And you know what? Maybe you just have no interest in Korea at all, and that's okay. Um, anyways, let's not waste any time, okay? And let's get ready for the day, even though it's 2 30 in the afternoon. The day is still young. Oh, I got my toner, I got my deodorant, we're gonna slather this on, tie my hair up maybe because it's a little bit of a mess. Throughout the day, I'm gonna try to be a little bit more eloquent, ladylike, calm with my words. Um, also, this pajama set. Very cute, yeah? Very cute. Picking an outfit is probably one of the most time-consuming parts of the day. Partially because I'm like, okay, the weather outside right now is freaking weird. So basically, I just like don't know what to wear ever. And I feel like every single time I put on an outfit, no matter what, just it just gets difficult. Think about the thing about the thing about oh. fashion choices is that like I'll I'll put on like you know just like a basic like white tee and like sorry I couldn't find Licky in your music guys I really don't like it when you do that Siri it's not make me feel safe whoa I actually don't have any pants on and I almost just zoomed out way too far that'd be illegal yeah I don't know what I'm trying to say right now okay so I saw this whole like this blouse like. Pinterest thingy. Are you supposed to like unbutton it evenly and then like tuck it in? But the way that the girl did it versus the way that I am doing it, I, I think she just she it just looked somehow like better on her and I don't know if it's because I'm doing it wrong. I've really been into like the effortless chic like look like I'm an adult but I'm not but hi I just woke up like this but it actually took me an hour to get ready kind of vibe. And I don't know if I'm pulling it off or I just look stupid. Huh? Oh, hat. Today is gloomy. And in unpopular opinion, I seriously love gloomy weather more than sunny. I don't know why. It's just comforting. Yeah. So I was heading out the door earlier because, like, I'm leaving. Sorry, the lighting that happened. I was heading out and I was like, wait, where am I going? I was like, I don't even have a place picked out. But don't worry, I got you. Heat is like my worst nightmare. And for a person who's gonna live in New York and uh, lives in Korea right now, I should probably really get used to it. Look, I love the wind. Actually, no, I don't. Not when it's photos. No idea if I'm going the right way right now. But you know what? The roads all somehow connect to one another, right? Is absent. My mom, when I was a little kid, used to sing Avril Lavigne Complicated on the karaoke machine every single time. Our friends would be over and maybe that's why I'm obsessed with that song. But I can't stop listening to it. I'm also like highly obsessed with Suki Waterhouse. Her music and her voice is just all so... If you have a chance, you should really go listen to her stuff because she's insanely talented and I think deserves more credit. Guys, these two grandpas walked past me as I was trying to record myself. And like I have you guys on a tripod, you know? They both were just staring at me and I was like, okay. But then you know what they're probably thinking? Self-obsessed little tween girl who just wants to take photos and videos of herself all the time. That's probably what they thought, right? First thing that you should do, honestly, if you don't want to do anything touristy, is just search in your area. Area. There, I mean, there are like definitely like hot spots that I feel like everybody wants to go to, but those lines for those cafes are insane. And there's so many underrated cafes that you can find. Just do is download Neighbor, look on Neighbor, and you'll see, just type in cafe and like a list will pop up. Or just go on Instagram and like type in like Myeongdong Cafe or something. So many options will pop up. There's so many aesthetic cafes. A lot of aestheticness in Korea. And so as it got more developed, cafe hopping I feel like is a must. Also, if you want to be a real local, you should seriously get a too many card take public transportation because first of all it's a lot cheaper than taxi second of all it's what almost every queen does here unless you're too famous third of all it's honestly so convenient with getting around and it's really clean it's not like new york's where it's like Ugh. okay so i came to soul forest because i really feel like or not soul forest well i'm going to soul forest home sudong is like where you have to go it's been called like the brooklyn 
of New York. I did not mean Brooklyn of New York, I meant Brooklyn of Seoul. Here's the thing, on the subway, I got this burning urge, this sensation. So far, this is probably one of my favorite parts of Seoul. What I'm trying to say here is that I had this urge, okay? I had this like, you know when you just want something so bad? This passionate feeling that I need need to go get a acai I'm a basic little hoe that is from California and I love my acai bowls. and I seriously haven't had an acai bowl so long in seven months it's a lot of deprivation of acai bowl. I looked for one and I actually found one then guess what? you know what happened? freaking try to call them right? calling them and I'm like trying to see I'm in the subway station just sitting on the bench looking like a little loser they're closed they like permanently closed down next Bible place that I can find is all the way in Gangnam and I'm not gonna hop back on the subway station just to go get an acai bowl, am I? Okay, after so forest I'm genuinely contemplating going to Gangnam and getting an acai bowl, but I, I don't know if this is gonna be like a good idea well clearly it's not really a good use of my time but the thing is like if I'm trying to make an interesting video like shouldn't I go there? No, and I didn't <sighs> tripped and almost fallen twice Guys, I found myself a smoothie. Not a smoothie bowl, but a smoothie. That place is literally right by Soul Forest, and it is getting more windy. In Soul Forest, if you want a good cafe, that one is just like convenient, and the smoothie was really, really good. If I say Soul Forest one more time, they, they, Rachel, were in Soul Forest. Soul Forest has like a skate park too. How nice it is just to walk around. Just like relax and enjoy the view. I love coming here and reading my book. I was having my phone charged in there, so I was reading my book in the cafe. The man's was playing Adele and it got me in my groove. So after I sit in the park a little bit, I'm gonna go to a Norebang. Those awesome buildings back there. Guys, you have no idea how excited I am right now. If you don't come to Korea and you don't do Norebang, you have not experienced the whole Korean way. You just have to search up on neighbor coin notebook. They're so cheap, so convenient. I think like an hour and a half. I'm telling you, Nodibang is everything here and that you need to check it out. If you enjoy the day today, 